All right, so this lady right here, Anne Marie, my best friend. And Hi, I'm Anne Marie. Allie and Echo. Um, this is from my YouTube channel, and we are having a broadcast. I'm honored to be on Leanna's YouTube channel. Um, today's um, I haven't been on her YouTube channel before, so I'm really excited. Yeah. She's asked me to come on here and um hang out with you guys today, so I'm excited. And she's from Nashville. Uh, I am from Tennessee. Nashville. I'm from Nashville. Mm -hmm. I uh, made the drive up here, and I'm hanging out with uh, Lizzie tonight. Yep. And we're having a great time. We've already been doing some dancing. Yep. It's been great, and now we're having a little talk show segment. Yes, we are. All right. So, I'm going to take some questions, and you're going to answer my questions. Okay, oh, how about that, people? It. Am I in the hot seat? Yes, you are. Okay. Yes, in the hot, hot seat. seat. Hot seat, okay. All right, ask, my ask first, me anything. My first question, Emmy. Yes, Lily. My question is, what do you do in your life? What do I do in my life? Yeah. Like, as my job? Mm-hmm. Okay, well, right now, I'm technically still a student. I know, kind of lame. But I am, so I'm student teaching, though, because I'm starting to become a teacher. Mm -hmm. So I'm currently student teaching. And I'm on, not that I'm counting down, but today was day 55. So I have 20 days left of student mm -hmm. teaching. And when, when I get done, I will graduate in December. And I'm going to her graduation as well. Yeah, we're just going to pull up to the yeah. graduation. I'm, I'm super excited about that. And I might probably take some photos of her. Yes. Oh, that would actually, sorry, guys. Actually, it's perfect because I need someone to take my picture. Oh, we do. For free. No. No, 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 no. No, it's okay. You don't need to pay me. You're messing. Yeah. We're family. Yeah. We're like, we say best friends, but we're kind of sisters, too. Yeah. He's like a god sister to me, and he's adopted. Yeah. And I'm going to say that he's adopted to me, and I just. The first time I met her at camp, one for me, I just want to say that the first time I met her, she is a wonderful person to me, and she's a good friend, and instead of a friend, I just want to tell my friend Emily, not, I mean, I mean Emmy, you are adopted to me. You're my family now, Amen. and you are my real sister. Mm -hmm. Sisters. Yes, we are sisters. You heard it here first, people. Yeah. You sisters and the misters. Yes, yeah, sisters before misters. I got right. Yep. Always. And we're going to talk about, and my, next, and my second question, okay. we're going to talk about God. God, yes. And we're going to say a little bit of words about that. Okay. And you go first. Just, just talk about him? Mm hmm. Okay. Um, well, I am... Yeah, teach other people about it. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah so teach, teach, teach other people about mm -hmm. God. Okay. So, um, if you ever have not come into, um, or if you grew up in a belief system or not, I think, um, that God is the single most important thing in our lives, you know? Mm -hmm. I think that He is ruler over all of all, of all creation. Yep. The whole universe. And, but even though he is ruler of, of all of those big things, he still cares so much about us all, like individually, which I yes, think is yes. amazing. Yes. And I'm grateful that he sent his son to die on the cross and save our sins. Yep, Jesus correct. Christ. I'm yep. thankful for that because I am too. It saved our, you know, it, 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 he mm -hmm. saved us from our sins, you yeah. know. And we just here to talk about yeah, it. Yeah, and, and, we and one day we're going to be able to live in heaven with him because of yes. Jesus' sacrifice. So, yeah. He did. We really owe it all to him, truly. And this is a good sample right here. My sister, Emery. And I just need to tell you guys that we both are a Christian. We both believe in God. And we both love reading the Bible. Yes. And if anybody don't like to read the Bible, that's okay. Mm -hmm. It can be very daunting at first yeah. because it's such a... It's such a large book. Like, mm -hmm. it's, it's so big, and you might not know where to it's start. Like 60, but... It's like 60 pages in the book. Yeah. The like, yes, there, there's a lot of pages. You might not know where to start, but yeah. really just, just a little bit of time. Honestly, mm -hmm. sometimes when I don't know what to do, I just open a random page and just start from there, you know? Yeah. Just as long as you're just reading it and getting yeah. some word in. and There yeah. are a bunch of programs out there. Yeah. I know um, I have an iPhone, and I'm sure it's on Android, too, but... There's mm -hmm. just the Bible app, and 
it gives you a Bible verse every day, and there's different reading and plans you can do. And also, you can get yourself a journal, and that helps yes, as journal. well. And you can start writing that, and uh, you can write down your thoughts and hopes and dreams and whatever you do in life. And mm -hmm. if you have jobs, and schooling, um, you can do schooling with your kids. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter what age you are, you can still do yeah, schooling. Definitely. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, it's like good to, homeschooling. Yeah, you can yeah. do homeschooling. That way, if you homeschool them, you can kind of control like what they're hearing per yeah. se. You can make sure they're hearing like good stuff. If you can God. see her shirt, where it says, that's the that's the main it part. It says life, love, and the God of grace. Yep. And he is truly a God of grace. Yes, yeah, he is. We mess up time and time again, but he extends his grace to us. Yeah. That's, that's very important. And then tonight, we're going to have spaghetti and meatballs for oh, yeah. dinner. There's been some spaghetti and meatballs cooking. I can smell it. I'm very excited. And we have salad. Oh, salad too. It's, it's gonna be very. I'm very excited. It's gonna be very yeah. yummy. And um, I got a third question. I'm gonna ask yeah. my, my sister. Hit me. Hit me. The, this is the main one. Though. It's a really tough one, but you might take. You might probably take it. Okay. This one. This question is about when do you first start to read your Bible? When you are in a, um, if you have anxiety sometimes. Do I have anxiety sometimes? No, I'm, I'm going to say when you have anxiety, when you start to read your Bible. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm saying. Like does, like, does it help reading my yes. Bible? Yes, I would say that any time that I'm feeling anxious or have anxiety about anything, that's definitely a good thing to fall back on is just to go. Um, read the Bible because it not only calms me down, but it gives me hope in situations where I might not feel hopeful. It like kind of grounds me, I would say. Mm -hmm. So, the next question is for you to ask me. Okay. 